What about the New York Rangers? Speaking of goaltending, we mentioned Louis Deming in net. The Pittsburgh Penguins had Deming in net, and the guy that was their backup was Alex DiOrio, who essentially lost his job earlier this season in the ECHL, the sixth goaltender on their organizational depth chart. And yet, the Penguins are able to kind of hang in it a bit until the end. The Rangers certainly get a little bit of a uh, more emphatic effort uh, converted on more chances. But the Penguins, the interesting thing for me, Matt, is if even though this series is tied 1-1, I'm certainly not willing to say that the Rangers are in the driver's seat as the series shifts to Pittsburgh, largely because they haven't demonstrated to me yet that they can keep Sidney Crosby in check. Yeah, I agree with you. And to me, this series is exactly how I expected it to play out so far. The Rangers have more star power. They have the goaltender. They can steal the series. The Penguins are the better five-on-five -five team. And you see it. The chances in the series have been pretty even. We knew goaltending was going to be the difference, whether it was Tristan Jari or Casey DeSmith or now Louis Dubing. It was the advantage the Rangers were always going to have. And you look at game two, the score sheet was in their favor, of course. But the territorial play was pretty even. We also knew the Rangers, they're very reliant on their power play. They're a pretty mediocre team at 5-on-5 five five this year. Very good power play. They do get one of their goals in Game 2 on the power play. So I'm expecting it to sort of stay this way, where the Penguins are going to be the team that generates maybe more chances, keeps the play pretty even, especially 5-on-5. Five five. But the Rangers' star power, I think, is eventually going to start sort of shine through and eventually put them through in the series. But it's going to be close, I think, back and forth. Yeah, it's, I'm sure Rangers fan had their hearts in their throats when they saw Igor Shesterkin go down with that sort of freak play collision with Jeff Carter uh, with just a couple minutes left in regulation with the Rangers up by three goals.